involved into bullying and racism toward black and biracial students. The allegations were first reported by our partner Colorado Community Media last week. Well, now the family is working with attorneys for change and accountability, they say, within the Douglas County School District. Good evening, I'm Karen Lee. And I'm Michael Spencer. Our Connor McHugh spoke with Lacey Gansey and her son Jeremiah about what they say they've experienced. He's a very dedicated student. Known as bright but introverted, Jeremiah Ganzi is in a situation he never wanted, questioning whether he'll ever return to Castle Rock Middle School. I just feel that I'm in danger. For a week and a half now, the eighth grader's answer has been no, a decision mom Lacey acknowledges may never change. I knew that this time we needed to make sure that there was more light shined on what was going on within the school. Lacey Ganzi says last month a staff member questioned Jeremiah for stealing a water bottle weeks after he'd reached out to the district concerned about profiling and racism. Then the next day in a meeting at the school he shared messages from classmates in a student group on Snapchat. We should, Jay, remove blacks from this planet. Ganzi screenshotted some of those messages. In one, a student suggested bringing back the Holocaust. Others included racial slurs and even threatened violence against black people. These were 12 and 13 year old children. It was disgusting. Ganzi not only pulled Jeremiah from the school, but also went to the district and filed a police report. Since then, she says one student was suspended for five days, but another faced no discipline. I've lost sleep every single day since it's happened. I feel like I'm the one that has to get away from all of it when I'm the victim. Last week, the Gansies expressed their frustrations before the school board, sharing Jeremiah's case, but also past hate his older sisters say they experienced too. I was called um, a on the bus by multiple different students. The family says the district needs to do more to support students of color. They're now calling for clearer hate speech policies and a new victim's advocate for the district. I want to be the last family that was ran out of Castle Rock, and I want my son to see that what he did for standing up was worth losing his friends, his home, and his community. Now, the Douglas County School District tells us it is continuing to address this matter internally, saying in a statement, it is our goal to take care of each and every one of our students in our district. We appreciate the Gansey family bringing their concerns to us so they can make sure our system is addressing their needs. Mm -hmm. The family is now working with attorneys to explore their possibilities of a civil rights suit in federal court. All right, Connor, thank you. Connor covers all that is happening in Douglas County, so send in your story ideas to him. You can reach out through cbscolorado.com. You can also call 303-863-TIP.